Yeah, you know, it's something you can continue to build. There's nothing like live game action, uh, the intensity of a game and stuff. So to be able to have that experience and then roll into another joint practice, I think it was good for me personally, but good for the team overall. Just your thoughts on, on what you guys did defensively in that first quarter? Uh, I think we did some things well, but, you know, uh, we have high expectations and we want to play at a higher level and we want to continue to get better. Uh, it's, it's been fun, you know. It, uh, it was always a competitive nature, uh, and that's what it was. What it was today, you know, going against guys I've, I'm pretty familiar with, but we're out there working and, and uh, you know, really trying to beat each other, and uh, that's how it should be. Is it kind of fun though? I mean, like the, obviously you forged a lot of friendships and bonds there, and, and to go against them in practice. I mean, any trash talking or anything of that nature? No, there wasn't no trash talking, but you know, we are we're all competitive, so we're out there, and uh, I don't want to lose, and I know they don't want to lose, and you know, we're out there competing. Uh, I think it's pivotal because you get you get uh, different formations. Every team does things a little differently, and, and you know as a def defensive guy, you get to get to see how you're going to adjust the different things that uh, the offense does. So I think it's good preparation for the season. Uh, you know, he demands a lot from us. He demands excellence, you know, um, so it, he nev he's never satisfied. If we think we have a good day, he's always, always, you know, pushing us, uh, showing us ways we, we need and should get better. And I think it's, uh, you know, making everybody's, uh, you know, awareness and everybody's, you know, intensity rise every day. What's going to be the strength of this group? Uh, I think it's going to be just continuing to get better. You know, I think that's our focus. We're worried about today and we got to go watch this film and try to get better for tomorrow. So what about, we, we hear the terms multiple over and over and over. You're going to rush a bunch. We know that. I mean, when you think about the term multiple and the strengths of what you guys can be, what does that mean to you? Uh, you know, we, we can do a lot of different things. So it depends what the offense has given us and what we feel is best. What about from a physicality and a toughness standpoint? What do you see from this defense? Uh, I think we have an opportunity, but we got to show it every day. You know, we got to be consistent, and that's what we're working to build. You know, we're still on camp mode, and every day we're trying to grind it out. Uh, you know, there's no light at the end of the tunnel. We're, we're grinding it out day in and day out. Uh, it's nice to have him. You know, he's big, physical, strong, fast. You know, he, uh, great player. So it's, it's good to see him uh, back out there. Uh, not really. You know, I got to shake hands with a lot of guys I built built great relationships with. But when we we're between the lines, it was it was work. You know, I wasn't trying to lose, and they weren't trying to lose. Did you get to catch up with out there? Um, you know, Red Ellison, Mark Herzlick, Landon Collins, Odell, you know, uh, played a long time with a lot of those guys. You guys, you guys struggled against the run against the Raiders. Um, we don't know if Stephon's going to play on Friday, but would you, uh, would you like to be able to face him to test your, test your run defense against the better guys? We control what we can control. We're worried about tomorrow and trying to have a, a better practice tomorrow than we did today. Uh, you know, continuing to identify the things we can work on, the things we can improve, uh, and, you know, taking it day by day. I know it's the opponent, but was it good to see Odell back out there and just running around? I mean, obviously, you, you know, know him pretty well and everything. What was really your impression? You know, for, on a personal level, he's a good friend of mine, and I'm glad to see him healthy and being able to uh, do what he does. Devon, you guys had uh, one QB that no sacks in the preseason over. It's also just a preseason game. Um, what sort of concern do you have about the lack of the passer? Let's get better. You know, that's that's uh, disappointing. I don't care what it is. So, um, you know, continue to get better. What have you been doing to get back to the area? Uh, you know, everybody's working hard every day. You know, this pass rush is a part of the practice. So they're pass rushing. We're pass rushing. I know you've only been in Detroit for a short time, but if you had to give your former Giant teammates any kind of advice or say something about Detroit to them that, that you've learned about the city in your short time here, what would it be? Uh, I wouldn't say any, anything to them. You know, they're doing their thing. I'm doing my thing here. You know, I'm just focused on asked, hey, what do you think of Detroit? What's what have you been doing? What's it like? Uh, I, I love it here. I'm trying to trying to help uh, help this team win, and and uh, you know that's what I'm focused on. Appreciate it. Thank, Thank you. you.